How can you get 5,000 YouTube subscribers in five months? We're going to show you, not just tell you and talk about what you should do, but we're going to show you what we did and actually achieve that 5,000 in five months. Today we're talking about, you're just going to kind of share some success story with us. Uh, yeah, it's a story that, that people like to hear because it, it shows what we did to get certain results and so it's a kind of a, a story that you learn a lot from. Even me just reviewing the experiences and the analytics and everything, it allows me to, ooh, let's apply that again. I love it. And it's not, this isn't a viral story. This isn't one video went crazy. That's, that's, uh, those are outliers really in the whole scheme of things. This is just a good, solid, mm -hmm. smart way and still kind of eye-popping gaudy numbers. Yeah, so in, in previous videos, we've talked about my AMPT strategy on how to be real strategic. What we're gonna show here in review now is kind of the results and, and you'll get to see what that looks like in, in kind of the real time. So you've got this Live On Purpose TV channel. Yeah, this is the use channel as with, the basis of the story. Yeah, Paul Jenkins, he's a positivity psychologist, and I started working with him in November. Let me go to this screen here so we can see views a little bit bigger. All right, and you notice that the dates that we're looking at here, we started on November 6th. Okay. That's he had this channel before and he just posted min miscellaneous stuff, but over many years he had amounted to 235 subscribers. Okay, I and mean, you're going to just go right on top of that channel. Nothing changes, kind right, of a thing. Right, because okay. you already had a channel. Why not? You got 235 subscribers. It's better than nothing. Yep. Okay. So we posted our first daily video. In this case, daily for this channel means five videos a week. Okay. We started that on November 6th, and then you see that uh, we progressed along. Kind of the the kind of the peak of daily views was around 20, and so instantly we jumped up to a peak of around 100 or so. Uh, so we, you know more consistent content, you naturally start to get some more views. And then you see as we got into January and then into February, we started to see some some nice growth. And I, and I remember um, we were filming again and, and Paul said to me, hey, I saw that we got 200 views in a day. And it was, you know, just a, a week or so later, we surpassed 300 views a day. And we were getting pretty excited about that. So you're at, you're almost up to about 400 views a day mm -hmm. by February 12th. And then this obviously looks like a pretty good Great improvement, trajectory. yes. But then over the next week, let me show you what happened. Let me change the date to the 26th. Just go out to the following Monday, a week later. And uh, yeah, this is what we call a spike. Well, yeah, I would say so. Yeah. And this isn't, the video didn't go viral. Um, this is... Um, you know, you can yeah, check. Yeah. To what do you attribute views. that? How? Traffic sources come mostly from suggested views. So we talk about this in other videos. When you follow my AMP strategy, which we've done in in every case of of all the videos previously, you know, starting on November sixth, every video followed that AMP strategy. And when you follow that AMP strategy for four months, you'll get a spike. And this was actually just shy. Of, of four months. The four month mark would be March 6th. Oh, right. So you were near the end of February. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, so you can see here, you know, we jumped up to 623, 727, 942, 1201, 14, 17. Wow. Anyway. So. And how do you know that it's because of suggested views? Do you do you go online and look at it and say, hey, or do the, is there a reporting? In fact, tool? right here you can come to traffic sources. And over the same time frame, it'll it'll show you and see how the majority of this is purple. Right. Purple means suggested videos. Oh. So now you know that I'm not just making this stuff up. You actually have proof. Bless your There's, heart. <laughs> and so you you can drill it down and, and see all the others, but and there's YouTube search. The, yeah. So that would. Uh, and you can suggest. see, I mean, early on, you can see there's mostly red in some of these these yeah. peaks there because that's a big part of the amp strategy. But when you follow the AMP strategy combined with daily content for four months, then you show up in suggested videos. And it's so much easier to get wow. spikes like this than to worry about going viral. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't even understand most of this, but your watch time, you know, or whatever, is clearly has gone up, way up, right? Yeah. We're looking at well, watch for, time, Well, for watch views. time, it's saying that... Um, let, we can go back and I'll show you a watch time up here. We go to the watch time page and it will tell you a total. So over this, this span of time, the channel's had 128,000 minutes 
of, of watch time. That's how many minutes have, have what been watched cumulatively. Gotcha. Okay. And that, that's a big step that, that's important to YouTube. Um, and obviously it, it grew when YouTube started to suggest our videos. So I'm going to go back to, to our views and we can continue on with this story. Because when you have a spike, it doesn't continue to spike. A spike, there's always a... By nature, a, you know, it's by definition, yes. It'll, yeah, it'll, it'll come naturally back down. settle down. Of course, but, but then the baseline will be higher. Yeah, that's yeah. the word. That's the word that you want to... Uh, pay attention to is the baseline. So the next date, I'm, I'm going to fast forward clear to April 13th. So this is now I'm going out two another, and a half months later. Yeah, something month like and a half later. Month and a half, right? Okay. So you'll see that we actually we had a new baseline, and then we had another spike. We actually had another spike there, another spike there. Good heavens! And uh, this spike, you know, 9,000 views in a day made that that first week of spike <laughs> look minuscule. <laughs> And this, this is what happens. It's like you, you're, you just settle down from a spike and you're like, man, that was so cool. I want that to happen again. And when it does happen again, in every case that this has happened to me, it's, it's blown away and made the previous spike look, look minuscule. It's pretty fun. That it's, is really cool. Now, that's a few months ago still even from yeah, today. Yeah, this is, this is back in April. Did, did, his, did his subscriber base also increase commensurately? Or? It, it did. We're, we're above, uh, we're between five and 6,000 subscribers now from starting at, in November at, at 235. Yeah. yeah. Wow. It's fantastic. Let's go ahead and just uh, fast forward to today. Because we had a, we didn't have a spike, but we had a little surge of growth. Let's see if I just go. We're in June, right? We are, and obviously, if you understand the Nate method, you'll know that our today is not your today, <laughs> because we're shooting twenty of these. In so one you see that this this did settle down, and the new the new baseline was around, you know, somewhere between eleven hundred and two thousand. So between one and two thousand was the new baseline. One before we were getting excited about two hundred views in a day, three hundred views in a day. <laughs> Um, you know, right here, we were like, ooh, baseline of a thousand. We had a spike and it settled back down to that baseline, but then recently we kind of had a little, I don't know if you call that a little spike. Just yeah. make up a term. We'll call that a hill. A mini spike. We'll have a, we'll have a hill. Mini spike hill. The, the exciting thing when you have spikes is that, that they always have a, a higher baseline. It's, uh, it's really cool. And, and part of that is because you've grown in, in subscribers. So now your channel is just naturally bigger and, and, when before you'd post a video and you might get 50 views in the first day and then you have a spike and then after that every new video is at least getting 200 views it's great looking under the hood the nuts and bolts baby i love seeing the analytics i love seeing the graphs and things actually moving it's cool that that's what drives me i love i love results that's obvious yeah i love results i don't i don't like just creating something pretty and say look but if it doesn't get visitors or if it doesn't get clients or you can't see the stats help this man today by get by being oh, a visitor right. and and clicking like and yeah, subscribe like, if subscribe, you have it. click that bell yeah tell and a friend uh, we've got another amazing video coming next so stay tuned With no